Hi, I'm Ningyong. Hi, I'm Michelle Yap. Today, we are back at Carissa Park Condominium, which is a freehold development nestled in a private residential enclave in District 17. There are a total 14 blocks with 5 to 8 units. And today, we're going to showcase to you a pool-facing 3-bedroom, 1648 square feet. And Michelle, I'm so excited to show you. Let's check it out now. As we are walking, mm. you can hear the birds chirping. Yes, remember I told you this one is a pool facing. Ah. And then as we're walking up, right. it really feels like landed. Yeah. Because uh, you have one entrance in from here. Mm -hmm. And okay. then there should be another entrance. Yes, later I'll show you. Okay. Okay, cool. can you imagine even when you're in your own unit, yeah. you can see the beautiful pool view. Yes. Yeah, and the best thing is that you have very nice shades from this palm tree. Mm -hmm. Alright, so it gives you a very nice that like I said, landed. Over here mini garden. Yes! Right. So, for owners who have green fingers, mm -hmm. they have a whole stretch of area where they can do their uh, plants, exactly. flowers. The whole environment is very serene. Yeah. They also got nice birds chirping. Yeah. It's so relaxing. Yep. And the thing is that for this uh, private enclosed area, yes. right, they, said they have also done the shelter. Correct. Right. Even if it rains, you can be very safe. That's why they are able to have the carpentry out here to keep their things neat and tidy. Yes. Yeah. Agree. So agree. their gardening tools, they can keep it into the cupboards. It's a little bit like Australia, huh? Yeah, yeah it's like true. Like the, the garage area like that. Yeah, agree. Yeah. Then all right. this here is so well yeah. cut, you know, everything is correct, kept inside. Correct, correct. Yes. Yeah, I like it here. And then if you really like to, you mm. may also have a table out here. Yes. Where you can enjoy a cup of tea. Yeah. Or even a glass of wine with cheese. I like barbecue. Yeah. Can we do barbecue here, like Korean barbecue? Uh, well, if you want to, but I guess your neighbor may want to join you. <laughs> yeah, why not? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, maybe we can check out inside. Come, let's because go. if the owner has kept this whole place so beautiful, mm -hmm. I'm sure the the living room, the bedrooms, and all this will be in very tip top condition. Yes. Let's go. When you come in, mm -hmm. you realise you're stepping on a very nice, well-maintained marble floor. Yeah, and it's almost like new, you know, yes. so well-maintained. Right. I'm quite impressed, you know. Yeah, very impressed, right? Yeah. And you can imagine the, the sofa set is a huge one. Alright, so uh, basically for this unit, you can actually have another sofa set there if you have more people coming. Alright, and then where the sofa to the TV wall is also a very good distance. I totally agree. Yeah. And one thing I like about this unit, it gives you a very open kind of feel. It's mm -hmm. because from your living space all the way to your dining area yes. is really a huge stretch. Right. And I think I remember the ceiling height is about 2.9 meters. Approximate 2.9. Yeah. You are right. Yeah. Even if you put the four ceiling for the lighting yes. and the aircon, right? You don't feel like oh it's so low and claustrophobic. Yeah, totally. exactly. You know? I still find that it's pretty good height. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then of course, like you said just now, the dining area to the living room, you can still have a nice section here. Yes. Okay, and it's a huge table here, but let's say if you want to extend, you know, to have it like 12 or 14 seater, uh. shouldn't be an issue at all. Yeah. Like you have your party at home, mm -hmm. you know, this stretch of the wall, you yep. can even put like a buffet table, buffet right? Buffet cater catering table. Uh, buffet yeah. catering table, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Then you can spread them. Yeah, so it's like your guests can literally move around your entire living mm -hmm. area yeah, freely, yeah. comfortably, and everyone can still interact with one another. Exactly. Especially now, you know, people just want to gather together, families, yeah. you know, so this area is confirmed more than enough for them. And then um, this is the main entrance. Main entrance, right? Because yeah. just now we came in from the private enclosed space. Yeah, like the garden entrance. Yeah. Right? So now this main entrance, come. We just check it out. Sure. Okay. You see, if you have guests coming from the car park, oh, they can even nice. come from here. See? Okay, and then of course the owner did a very nice uh, shoe cabinet here. Yeah, you can even put your shoes here. Yeah. But you know, it doesn't yeah. get into your space. Right. But if right. you really want to have another cabinet inside, there's definitely more than enough space. Definitely. You yeah. know, and one thing I like about these doors, right, for uh, this uh, development, mm -hmm. okay, they have a very wide door. So if you have a huge delivery of furniture, right, you can actually open up. Okay, so even cool. like fridge and all these things, there's no issue at all. Nice. Mm. Okay, it's very nice. Yeah, right. it's, it's always like, you can feel it's very neat and tidy. Yeah. The Oh, no, it's very house proud, that's what I said. Uh, in fact, a new buyer, right, if they were to come in, yes. all right, uh, literally they can leave the floor alone. Mm -hmm. Okay, they can leave quite a fair bit of things alone. Later when we check out, you'll know. 
Mm. So okay, sure. should we check out the kitchen? Sure, let's Come, go. Let's go. Even the kitchen has been totally renovated by the owner. Yes. Right. I remember the flooring. The original flooring is not this. Right. And the choice of the flooring makes the whole place uh, brighter. Brighter. Yes. Yep. And then yeah. it also feels that it's very welcoming. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, they have a nice area for two door free. I think the owner has actually kept everything very well. Uh, yeah. The quality of the carpentry work yeah, is really very good. fantastic. All right. Right. And then yeah. they even have the built in uh, microwave oven. Yes. Oven. And it's very they are also right. very decent brand. Yeah. You know, we have like oh, Franco. Okay. Right. Yeah. Nice. And one thing I like about here is that they took down the wooden door. Oh, okay. okay, so it became like more welcoming when you enter. Mm. Okay, then of course this glass will give uh, the natural lighting mm -hmm. into the you kitchen. Itself. Yes. And then this yard area, oh, there's another uh, washing area before you put your laundry into the washer. Yes. Alright, and then all the detergent are kept there. Mm. Okay, yes. Michelle, you look at this. It's like a room. If you have a helper, Oh. You can have a helper in here because this is <laughs> like a wardrobe. Yeah, the wardrobe for the helper. Mm -hmm. And then if let's say you decided to convert this into a bed area, yeah. I think this you can put on a bed. Yeah, yeah, like the Murphy. Bed. Like the Murphy bed, yeah. Oh. Right. I mean, this is obviously now it's a storeroom. Mm. You know, but then again, everything is so neat because sometimes we see the storeroom is like wow, everything like almost tumbling down. Correct. But this is all so neat. I think it's simply amazing. Yeah. Even the top part, you have a shelving space. So you can put some stuff, right? They leave no space behind. Ah, okay. No space untouched. Everything very efficient. Yeah. Okay, and then this one, of course, let me check it out. What is that? Ah, there is the ah. yard toilet. So if you have a helper, then the helper can use this toilet. And even the yard toilet is very well taken care of. You know, if you uh, don't tell me that this is a yard toilet, uh, it looks like the usual powder room? Yes, uh, like a powder room because correct. everything is like the tiles are nicely done. Uh. It's all very nice. Yeah, and okay, for this yard area, mm. they also use the laundry gadget which is easy for you to manage. Uh, so the new owner will be able to enjoy this benefit correct. for sure because it's all the fixture. Correct. Wow. Because uh, normally for like kitchen, yes. carpentry work, yep. as well as all the wet works, they are one, right, of, the most one expensive. of the most expensive yeah. component of the renovation. Right. So the new owner actually saves a lot, a lot. from it. Yeah. yeah. Because they are not only of good quality, mm. but they're also very well maintained. You are very right. Yeah. Come, let's go and check out the rooms then. Let's go. Michelle, let's go and check out the rooms. But before we enter, you know that this door here, star room. Yes. Um, everything is just like wow. I can only so wow because it's so so neat. Yeah. Even the flooring in this store room yeah. is so well maintained. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's that's something which is uh, quite amazing I don't know. I must use my thumbs up and <laughs> use my toe up as well. Nice. Okay. Let's check out the first room. So now we are stepping on parquet flooring, right? Mm. Usually parquet flooring, uh, if you agree with me, right, it's the one of the most difficult uh, after many years to still maintain at this tip-top condition. Yes, agree. Right? Yeah. yeah and then uh, this room is super big, although they put a uh, super single bed. Yeah, super single and then you still have a space for really like a L-shaped work desk. Yeah. Right, and then you have your built-in wardrobes. Right, uh, and it's a full height one. Yes, it's full height. Mm. So so they literally make use of the height space. Mm -hmm. And you still have a lot of plenty of space to walk around in yeah. this room itself. If right. you want to put a queen size bed, I'm sure definitely no issue at all. Correct. But with a super single, you mm. have more space to play around with. Yes. You know, like imagine the kind of uh, furniture and fixtures that can fit into this room. Exactly. The wardrobe is in very good condition. So let's say the new buyer were to come in, right? They can don't renovate this part because they mm -hmm. can still keep it and save quite a fair bit. Yep. The door has been replaced for all the three rooms. Yes. Okay, and this is not the normal wooden door. Yeah. So it's very, uh, it's more aesthetic look. Yeah, correct, correct. correct. Okay, let's check out the other room first. But before we enter, mm -hmm. okay, this is a nice uh, home office area. Yeah, I think it's very well used of this space. Yes. Where you can even put like the top hung cabinet, the right. top cabinet, mm -hmm. then you have an area for your work desk. Yes. And you can fit in your like monitor, your printer, everything. And oh, just perfect. nicely tuck here. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. And then of course the, we talk about the common bathroom. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have the wet and dry, huge window there. Yeah. 
the exhaust fan if you look from top to bottom everything here feels like a hotel toilet yes okay uh, they even have this uh, built-in uh, hair dryer. dryer yeah yep. okay if you look at the design of mm. this bathroom firstly i find that it's very timeless yes you know whoever um, buys it over mm. you know it's something which they can inherit totally secondly agree. is the way the vanity cabinet is being done yes so there is no so space that, up yeah so it's easy, easy for clean. cleaning yeah even like the uh, wall yeah it's really tiles and it's so well maintained exactly they are also using very quality Correct. uh you know all these finishes like hands pro hey toto Correct. even for the yeah I, yeah even the wc is toto yeah right remember we were saying that wet works is really one of the most, most expensive component of the renovation exactly i'm excited so i believe the new buyer should be I'm very sure, excited as well i'm sure i mean even for this common room mm -hmm. similarly you can fit a queen size bed definitely no issue and yeah. i think after you fit a Queen size bed, we can have a space for mm. a side table. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then whether you want to have a study desk or a work desk in this room, it's yep. really up to the new owner. Agree. Mm. Shall we check out the master room? Yeah, let's Come, go. let's go. Ah, one thing good is that all the rooms are tucked on one side. So yes. all the privacy is on one yeah. side, right? Yeah, so, so the moment you walk into the walkway, yep. it's all the bedrooms ready. Right. Yeah, and this master room tears the privacy all the way to the end to the and end. at the corner mm -hmm. with natural lights coming into the room. Yes. You know, and you can even fit a king size bed if you want to because previously this room fits a king size bed. Right. And they even have space for two side tables. Awesome. You know what I see? I see two sets of wardrobe. Wow. Behind you is a three door okay. full height wardrobe. Nice. And then uh. opposite us, okay, is two, four, five, five doors. Can you imagine if new owner were to come in? Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe the hubby can take one side, the wife can take one side. Yeah, and yeah. what is amazing, right, Ning, even with these two sets of wardrobes, yes. right, there's still plenty of walking space exactly. for us. Can you, can you imagine? Exactly. Yeah, I mean, I can still walk very freely, comfortably, and in front of the bed, you can still have a maybe like a TV wall. Mm, or a dressing or, table. Yeah, dressing table, exactly. Yeah, so this room is awesome, the size. Yeah. I mean, it's very difficult to find such sizes these days. Okay, I simply love this unit because firstly, it gives very nice uh, natural light coming into yes, the house, yes. right? And then secondly, everything is so spacious. Right. right? Thirdly, it's so well maintained. Mm. And you know, fourthly, is whereby it is pool facing. Exactly. Right? And then you have that mini garden in front of you. Yeah. It's like very welcoming to it's come like home every single Everything you want has a day. tick, right? Yes. Yeah. Exactly. I love it. Come, Ning, let's check out the amenities. Yeah, yeah, come, let's go. Let's go and check it out now. Wait, just a moment. Oh, yeah. We forgot about this one. Yeah. Now. You, saw, you see, you know why we miss out, Michelle? Because it's like so tucked in this corner. Exactly. <laughs> I don't even go in there. Exactly. Place. And then the glass <laughs> door doesn't feel like it's a bathroom, right? Yes. See? Now, this is also like a hotel toilet. Yeah. Okay, where they have the um, hair dryer inbuilt. Similar concept as yeah. the common bath, and they also use the Hans Rohe exactly. tap head. Yep. Right. Wet dry oh. area. Okay, to me, very important there must be a window for ventilation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the owner has actually done this quite interestingly. Oh, this is I don't know whether they will, they will leave this here, but this is definitely a very a uh, good net to prevent mosquitoes, la, lizard. La. Not as if they have it here, yeah. but it's just that it's something that the owner has thought about. Mm, you know? Correct. And then even this bathtub, right? Usually yeah. you know that bathtub are quite like oh those kind of very yes. brown kind of look, right? Yes. But this one is a very timeless. Yeah. Very, very clean, modern, very modern. So whether you love a soak mm? or you love a shower, yep. you have a choice of both. Exactly. So now you know now we, why why we miss here, but <laughs> I thought we didn't okay, miss this part. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's we going to check out the amenities okay, now. Come, come, come. Yeah. Carissa Park has full condo facilities with not one but two tennis courts, two swimming pools, a squash court, which is really rare these days, a gym that is equipped with the latest equipment and weights as well as dedicated dance or yoga section. For the outdoor fitness area, we have multiple areas for adults or even elderly to do their workout. And we even have dedicated basement car park for residents and ample parking for guests at the level one. 
For residents in Carissa Park, they can grab their cravings at the holding area where there are dispensaries, machines, at their convenience, or daily necessities from the main mart at the opposite condominium. And for more options, the 24 hours NTUC Express at the nearby SO station or leave at Changi is a place where mostly frequent by the residents here. Whether you're looking for fresh dailies or more food options, you're just a short drive to Loyang Point where you have Sengshong Supermarket, Giant, choice of two food courts, and even fast food joints and many more. And for more activities, you can also catch a movie or access to more FMB offerings at the nearby eHub at Downtown East. And for some who prefer a one-stop shopping for the whole family, but just seven minutes drive away to Tampanese Retail Park where you have Ikea, Colts and Giant. And if that's not enough for you, you may continue to shop at White Sands Shopping Mall or three mega malls at Tampanese Central too. This block is located near to the side gate where it is recently upgraded with a biometric system for residents to exit and head to the nearby bus stops where they can access to bus number 4 that travels to both Tampines East MRT Station and the Tampines MRT Station as well as the bus interchange. And for those who drive, it's easy access to TPE, ECP and PIE and it's only 10 minutes drive to Changi Business Park and 5 minutes drive to Changi Airport and the Jewel. For parents with young school-going children, there are a total of 7 primary schools and 2 of them are within 1km which includes East Pink Primary and White Sands Primary. From here, it's just a short walk to the Japanese school and a short drive to the Singapore University of Technology and Design as well as 3 other international schools such as UWC Southeast Asia East Campus, Middleton International School and the Global Indian International School East Coast Campus. If you are a ground floor lover who is looking for a freehold 3 bedroom apartment in the East that is renovated and in good moving condition and love and enjoy the beautiful pool view from a private enclosed space and from your home, this could be the ideal unit for you and your loved ones. Okay, if you like what you see, do connect with us. I'm Ning Yap. I'm Michelle Yap. And do remember to subscribe to our YouTube channels for more home tours like this. We'll see you soon.